begins to start it. Welcome back Philippines! Dito po sa loob ng Cuneta Astrodome. Yan po ang ating score sa magpapasimula ng ating ikatlong yugto. Ito po ang Game 1 ng 1996 Governors Cup Championship Series Alaska Milk Laban sa Hinebra San Miguel at may konting adjustments kinito Val David starting out dito sa third quarter samantalang sa panic naman ng uh, Alaska Milk nandun si Bong Hawkins kagaya na sinabi ni Anthony Suntay he will start despite his four fouls and Fed Kogin again connecting on a triple V parta niyo sinabi ni Butch Maniego in the report from Hinebra San Miguel Robert Jaworski not happy with the way he's called shot. Actually, 50% shooting in Ember San Miguel nung first half. At ang Alaska, only 42% fair shooting. Nagkatalo kasi, he, uh, Alaska had 13 more field goal attempts. Yan, nakita natin sa ating halftime summary. Dapat napag-usapan na, na, dapat napag-usapan ng Hinebra San Miguel kung bakit sila uh, nakakuha lang ng 30 field goal attempts oh. as against 43 for Alaska. And the answer is rebounding at saka yung turnover sila. Napakarami. And of course, the lack of offense from Vince Heason was, that was only his first field goal attempt. Well, si Vince Heason, one point pa lamang dito sa larong ito off a technical foul free throw. Kamandala si Val David nasa pagdina, pumasok at tira, may foul pa. At mula kay Johnny Amariento. Val Parker, harap-harap pa yun. Val David, the flash, taking it in the face of Johnny Abariantos. Swak! At may extra shot na ibibigay kay Val David. At ang abante po ay naagaw na ng uh, Hinebra San Miguel. They're on top here by 143-42. Chambers na libre. Umangat, masyado malakas. Rebound ni Cofield. Yan din yung medyo hindi natin masyado nakakita sa first half. Fred Cofield helping out in the rebounding source. Well, you look at his numbers, only two boards so far. Isa lamang ang rebound niya in first half dinito. Yes, and Fred Cofield, although he plays the off-guard or point-guard position, dapat tutulog din siya sa rebound. Especially if the Twin Towers do not have the mobility to get the rebounds. And then as the season. Going to his cross side. Wala! Maganda yung depensa ni Jojo Lastimo sa laman kay Vince Season. He's on still uh, just with one point from the technical free throw. Two missed field goals here very early in the second half. Yan ang tagilid. Pag uh, si Chambers ang tumao si Cofield, ano, Philippine, he just showed us why mas malakas ang upper body nitong si Sean Chambers. Yes, well, si Fred Cofield ang uh, mukuha kay Sean Chambers. Dapat eh, upisahin niya yung kanyang pressure defense up high because once Sean, po Sean Chambers posts him up low, Fred Cofield will not have the muscle to stop Chambers. Oh, yung ganda ng anticipation yes. ni Fred Cofield. Three on one break, three on two. Pinigay kay EJ Fan. Umangat. Oh, nasa pa lang pahaga. One fake. He goes up and he does not get the basket. Pero may foul na makukuha si Marlo Aquino. Laban kay Sean Chambers. Martin nakigil doon si EJ Fan. But he had the right move. He didn't put the ball on the floor. At saka nag-drop step siya on the way to the hoop. Yung nga lang, I think he was a little intimidated. Panoorin po natin muli. Just a drop step here by EJ File. I think he was intimidated. Oh, actually, that ball was tipped Gusto by Sean Chambers. Eh. Yes. Oh. Chaka Chambers bothered that shot. At si Marlo Aquino patuloy ang uh, ikangan niya paghihirap dun sa free throw line. He's struggling from the free throw line. Already zero out of three in this ball game. Si Marlo Aquino. The man of the hour for Hineba San Miguel is Fred Gofield already with 18 points in this game. Aquino, one out of two. Sa wakas, nakagawa si Aquino from the line. Marlo Aquino averaging only 60.6% from the free throw line. Abarientos. Nalalabing oras sa ating third quarter, 9-17, at may tinawag si referee Rivera. Illegal defense. A warning. Laban sa mga nakapula. DJ File loitering outside. At siya po ay natawagan ng illegal defensive alignment. Big gamble on the part of Coach Tim Cohn to play Bong Hawkins already with four oh. personal fouls. Yes. Picked up two fouls in the... or three fouls in the second quarter. Pasa ni Hawkins na antala ni EJ File. Labing dalawa sa kanilang shot clock. Nasa poste ngayon. Coach Winyo binigay ki. Sean Chambers na bangga ng konti ni Marlo Aquino. Mahanap ng outlet. Binigay. Anto si Sean Chambers. And a beautiful catch. Parang uh, si Jerry touchdown Rice. football. Oh. <laughs> Hawkins, dere dere to, ginamito na naman ang bilis, pero wala. Valdemir, looper kay Marlo Aquino, and they've been 
bungling opportunities here, Kinito. But I didn't understand why Marlo Aquino was the one who was targeted for those touchdown passes. No, he is not a good finisher of the fast break. Dapat yun si Vince Hison, who is a very good finisher in transition. But uh, one big adjustment that na we can see here in the second half is the fact that Fred Cofield now is being more assertive in the rebounding department. Ito na si Vince Hison. Ito ang sinasabi natin na finish. He still does not get the shot. Again, Lastimosa staying with Vince Hison. Tabla pa rin po ang ating talaan. 4-4-4-4. Hawkins. Napulabog. Ipa talaga ang disiplina ng Alaska in getting back down on defense to prevent the transition baskets. Maganda yung overplay ni Marlo Aquino. Nalipo si Lastimosa. Maikse. Cofield ang pupulot ng loose ball. And he says, dahan-dahanin natin. Oo, sabi ni Fred Cofield. Sandali. Hindi tayo nakakoscore si transition. Ako na muna magdadala ng bola. Alam mo, katakataka yan, Kinito, because these two teams are the best or the runningest teams dito sa PBA. Oh, Marlo Aquino sa loob! Yan ang dapat for Hinebra San Miguel to get Marlo in scoring position, not to get him to finish the fast break. And we have a timeout. Tabek palabas ni Bal David sa pasa kay Johnny Abarentos. Ang uh, Alaska Milk Kinito, tumawag ng maagang timeout pagkatapos na abangan, oh, lamangan sila ng Hinebra San Miguel. And obviously, nag-iisip na ngayon si Coach uh, Tim Co ng adjustments dito. Well, several things. No? Nakita siguro ni Coach Tim Co na medyo bumibilis na ang laro ng Hinebra San Miguel. Now, they've got two spark plugs on the floor, David and Hison. At uh, ito si Hison has already missed two transition attempts. Ito, bukukot sa labas ang Alaska. And a tip in! And that will count. Napako ang mga paa ng mga Hinebra San Miguel sa sahig. Ay palagay ko, lack of concentration. Oh. And again, lack of championship experience. Yes. Narinig nila yung buzzer. Akala nila, tapos na yung oras, pakukuha nila yung bola. Eh, hindi nila alam, eh, meron pa oportunidad. Ito ang Alaska to score. Si Aquino natapik palabas ang uh, bola of that miss. Commissioner Jun Bernardino, kanina na, na panood natin siya sa interview. Oh, si Shell uh, Top Hancho, Rainer Williams, and Senator Franklin Drelon, ang ating isang suki. Dito sa PBA. And si Mr. Meneses. Samantala, ito pong narong ito. Tuloy ang aksyon. Third quarter. Lastimosa, wala pa rin. Jojo Lastimosa has also struggled from the field. Kinito, only two points in the ball game. But he kept uh, the ball alive here for Alaska. Taking it out of the hands of Hizon. Again, the mobility in the half court. Another offensive rebound. Pangatlo nito. Baba naman. Nasaan ang mga rebounders? Marlo Kino's way out in the open court. Yes, hindi, hindi nakatulog si Marlo Aquino. Again, uh, he's being brought out by the offensive players of Alaska. Eh, ito naman si Marlo. Should move inside to help in the rebounding chores. Cofield, tumuloy ng baseline. Lumabas ang tira. So, balit, nakakakuha siya ng consolation prize. May foul laban kay Jojo Lastimosa. Ito yung last sequence kung saan katakot-takot ang offensive rebound ng Alaska. Isa yan, ha? Pangalawa na. At takuha na naman ni Kevin Ramas. Exploiting his wide body. And getting the shot off. And no reaction, no defensive reaction from EJ File. Didn't even bother to try to block the shot. Para kanina, napanggit mo that we have uh, so many viewers watching from the north. Oh. And we also have so many viewers watching from the south, particularly uh, the PBA fans in Tagibo, Butuan City, sa Patinay, Prosperidad, Agusan del Sur, sa Iloilo in the Visayas. Yes. We have uh, a lot of friends who are celebrating Christmas parties in Iloilo. And of course, uh, sa Captain Central Luzon naman, nandiyan ang uh, mga kaibigan natin from uh, Tanyedo Street sa Tarlac. All PBA fans watching this. Well, sa lahat po sa inyo, kami po'y nagagalak na makasama kayo sa Game 1 ng 1996 Governor's Cup Final Series dito po sa Cuneta Astrodome. Magandang gabi po muli. Sean Chambers ngayon, tumira. Tingnan natin, 3 seconds ang itinawag ni referee Laga. Okay. In that situation, Alaska wanted to move the ball inside because Jorge Lastimos had earlier attempted several times from the perimeter. Hindi sila nakakuhol sa labas. So they wanted to take the ball closer. As a result, hindi sila nakakuha ng good shot and it became tentative. Sama na naman ang entry pass. Kinito mula kay J.B. Gayoso. Masyadong gipit. Lastimos at tumira. He's only one out of six. Now one out of seven offensive rebound. Sapang sa likod. Mahal na binamay nila. Siya pa rin. Bal David laban kay Johnny Abarientos. Kofi, tumira sa labas. No. And no, no rebounder. Tinira ni Fred Kofi, the only one underneath the basket was Bal David. Hindi naman siya makakakunang rebound. Si Lastimosa, one out of seven. Si Vince Season, zero out of four. Dito sa first game. Samantala, Abarientos, nabitawan ng bola. 
Nagnanda sana ng pasa ni Kevin Ramas. Ganda. Hindi akalain yun. A wraparound pass. This is a very ano, ha, low scoring game kinito at uh, hindi typical of an Hilember game. Pero of course, ang Alaska nagihigpit sa kanilang depensa. Totoo yan. Actually, both teams are playing good defense. And Alaska not getting the outside shot to fall in. Pinapwersa nila sa loob. And napakatindi naman ang interior defense ng Hilembra because of the Twin Towers. Foul si, Vin or si JV Gayoso sa ilalim. Loose ball foul. Gayoso has not contributed dito sa larong ito at all at least positively. Ganito. Well, puro negative yata ang contribution ni JV Gayoso sa larong ito so far. And talking, talking about negative contributions, si Vince Hison has not scored a single field goal and uh, zero out of four. Yan ang uh, statistics ni uh, Vince Hison from the field. He has just one point from a technical free throw. Si Lastimosa ay hindi din maganda ang kanyang showing from the field. One out of seven with only two points. Nabulabog si Sean Chambers but he dives on the, to the floor. At may loose ball foul na itatawag laban kay Marlo Aquino. Si Aquino nakawagan ang loose ball foul. Again, nakikita mo yung hassle itong si Sean Chambers. Samantala, si Bong Hawkins papatang ngayon ni Jeffrey Cariaso. You see the hustle ni Sean Chambers, the yes. experience. Alam niyang hindi siya magpapatalo any possession in this game. Well, see, Bong Hawkins now resting on the bench. Parang uh, iba na ang galaw ni Bong Hawkins uh, realizing that uh, he's in foul trouble. And Coach Tim Cohn now keeping uh, or putting Bong Hawkins back on the bench. Backdoor play, sumabog sa mukha ng mga taga-Alaska. May foul, offensive foul si Johnny Abarientos. Third foul na rin uh, ni Flying A. Ating pong score, tabla, 48 all. At napako na tayo dito for quite some time now. That's true. Matindi in defense on both ends. Take a look at the block shot situation. Six for Hinebra because of the Twin Towers and only one for Alaska. Tap out ni Sean Chambers. Mananatili ang bola sa panik ng Hinebra San Miguel. Only 4.25 remaining sa third quarter. Three team fouls ang Alaska. Ang Hinebra San Miguel dadalawa. Very tight pass coming from uh, Val David from the inbounds. At may turnover naman ang Alaska. Kapit-kapit ang turnover, Kinita. And right now, the game has turned into a sloppy ball game. Not too well organized, no? I think uh, the players are feeling the jitters, no? Because this is such a um, closely matched championship series. Alam mo, nabanggit mo, Kinita, na doon si Fred Kofiut puputo. Or at least nabanggit ni Mr. Navarro, no? Puputo kito sa finals. Unusually, na tumukuha ito si Fred Cofield ng mas maraming tira, no? He's yes. getting a lot of shots in this game. Not only that, he's playing good defense, he's helping out off the boards, and he's proving himself as a good input. Uh, Gayoso na naman. Pangatlong foul lang ni JV Gayoso. Siya ang tumatao kay Lastimose. Yes, and the Hinebra fans getting a little restless. Ang ating po score, 50 ang Hinebra San Miguel, 48. Ang Alaska Milk, 3.48 remaining in the third quarter. It's been a very close game. The biggest lead was with Alaska, 9 points. Minti Santina niya, Barrientos, rebound, napulot ni EJ5. Pamontek na. <laughs> but Pamontek that time, na matangkal, the twin towers, twin towers combining very well underneath the boards. No white shirts around for the possible offensive rebound. Val David, who sinasingit sa ilalim, Mintis. EJ5 na nakakuha. Ilalabas niya sa kanyang point guard. Bumaybay ng baseline. Masyado malalim. Pero pumasok pa rin! Val David! Yes, dyan magaling si The Flash. Kaharap siya ng puwang, especially around the baseline. And he will challenge the big man's uh, uh, defense. And you notice, hindi niya titirahin yung mga big men ng uh, Alaska harap-harapan. Gagawa siya ng angulo and he will take it on the reverse. Good block mula kay JV Gayoso. It's a four-point lead para sa Hinebra San Miguel. Under three minutes to go. This is the third. Cofield, Lamanke Cariaso. Ten seconds on the shot clock. Turn around. Voila! Nothing didn't depend on Jeffrey Cariaso. Stop to Fred Cofield. Chambers. That may fall. I've been against JV Cariaso. Act of shooting. They begin at the free throw. See Sean Chambers. I'm going to talk about it. Galao. The flash. And the Laganamang. Sobra Pilis. I'm going to hit. Abate ang Ginebra ng apat. Eh, timeout po si Sunny Jaworski. Abate po ang Ginebra San Miguel ng apat na puntos at ang Alaska Milk. 
ay hindi pa nakakagawa ng puntos in the last 4 minutes may pagkakataon si uh, Sean Chambers na mabasag ang kanilang pagkakatahimik Carter, uh, talking about Alaska not having scored in the last 4 minutes etong update ng kanilang uh, field goal shooting 4 out of 18 from the field that's 22% hindi sila nakakapukul sa labas and they're trying to score from the inside at e tumitin din naman ang depensa ng Hinebra San Miguel sa loob and that's the reason why they're having problems kung hindi nakiklik ang outside shooting ng Alaska nahihirapan sila mahihirapan silang maka-score because of the inside defense naman of Hinebra San Miguel. Hinebra doing a slightly better, 30%, but still a very low percentage, 5 out of 15 from the field in this quarter. Isang field goal na lang ang nag-iiwalay sa Hinebra San Miguel mula sa Alaska Milk. 3 seconds sa shot clock ng Hinebra. Pimira si Gaby Gayoso sa labas. Wala. Rebound ni Kevin Ramos. Nakagawa ni Baldovin. Binigay kay EJ Fahl, pero hindi inaasahan. EJ Fahl, again, lack of concentration. Ganda sana nung pasa ni Bal David on the steal coming from the end line. Sinayang ni EJ File yung pagkakataon. Samantala, narito si Sean Chambers. Binigyan ng screen ng Lastimosa against JB Gayoso. Sean Chambers nakalusot. Goes up. Wala. Again, Marlo Aquino making him change his shot in midair. Yes. Kinito. A beautiful defensive help coming from Marlo Aquino. Nung nakita niya, napabayaan na si uh, JB Gayoso. Ni Sean Chambers, he came in, and talking about coming in. Yan naman, napapayaan niya ang depensa ng Alaska. The flash, Baldavid. Baldavid with six points. Lahat na gawa niya dito sa third quarter. A minute and a half remaining. Apat ang abante ng Hinebra San Miguel. Ito po ang game one ng best of seven championship series. Jeffrey Carriazo, lumusok. Sapal ni Gofield ng bagya. Nakuha ni Manlo Aquino. Partner, two straight blocks on the defensive end coming from... Uh, Hinebra San Miguel and they have been able to convert at least on one of those blocks. Patong ng ulo, yan ang play na tinawag ni Val David. 8 seconds in the shot clock. Pasa sa loob, natapik. Anticipated by Sean Chambers. 3 on nothing. Walang kalaban-laban. Stroll in the park. Alam mo, very obvious dito kinito. Hinahapon na ng bahagya. Ito si Marlo Aquino. Kanina nakita natin ang lalakad. Ngayon, medyo malam yan ang kanyang kalaw. Partner anticipated naman ng Alaska kung anong uh, play was going to emerge from uh, Hinebra in the previous uh, play, no? When oh. Val David signals the play, when he taps his head, yan ang gusto sabihin, ilolo post nila si Marlo Aquino. Oh boy. Pangapang na rin yan ni Sean Chambers. Nang tumulong siya kay Val David. Here's that play. He jumped out. At yun, kitang-kita naman. Tumama yung uh, tapik niya doon sa braso ni Val David. Sean Chambers with four, four personal fouls. Along with Bong Hawkins who's now resting on the bench. Si Lastimosa has been replaced. By Roel Gomez. He so, has been struggling. Aquino, naipit. Sa pa rin ng kapulot, pinailalim! Jack Magalik si Robert Jaworski. Again, he made things happen for Hinebra when the offense attacked the defense of Bong Hawkins in the first half, got him into foul trouble. Ngayon, Marlo Aquino has the green light to go against the defense of Sean Chambers. Chambers with four personal fouls. Only that much time remaining. Jeffrey Carriazo, pinil pinilit ang tira. Wala. Aquino with another rebound. Pinato. May tao ba? Nato si David Gayoso. And paubusin na siya ng oras. Sabali dito sa third quarter, ang Matic-Jeff combination ni David at Aquino combining for a total of 11. At abate na po ang Hinebra 